Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today is basically a video on what I do on a daily basis. It's like a day in the life of a teenage bodybuilder in quarantine. So I've been quarantined for like so long, I can't even remember. Like, I think it's been like over two months that I've been quarantined. I am allowed to visit my cousin. Me and my cousin have this thing where we're allowed to visit each other, but we're not seeing anyone else. Before we get into the video, make sure you like this video and subscribe. Don't forget to do that. And leave a comment what type of videos you guys want to see in the future. And also, if you haven't already, go check out my one-year body transformation. It was a really good video. I worked really hard on it. It'll be in the link in the description. And um, yeah, so I'm gonna try to do these like every day. I'm gonna try to make a video every day. That's my goal. So today I woke up around like 9 a.m., 9.30. And I got out of bed at like 10, brushed my teeth, you know, did all that stuff. Then I made breakfast. So as you can see in the clips right here, I made breakfast. I had eggs. I had four eggs. And what I like to do is I like to add some milk into that. And then I whisk it with a fork. And then I have a pan with butter. And then I put the eggs onto the pan. And then I let it cook. And then I do scrambled eggs. I add a little bit of spices and some sauce. And yeah, that's my eggs. And then I also have a power shake, which is a smoothie, which I add milk. A little bit of protein powder, kiwis and apples, and I put that in a protein shake and I shake that up. And then I have that with my breakfast. And I eat, I drink all of that, I try to finish all of that. It's a lot to have, but I, that's what I try to have in the morning. Cause I'm trying to eat more and I'm trying to drink more and I'm trying to just get bigger in general because honestly I'm still underweight for my height. I'm about six foot and I'm about 160. But recently I've been like eating a lot more and I think I got up to like 165. So I'm trying to make myself eat more and just be more healthy overall. So after I drink the power shake and eat breakfast, it's around like 11 or 10, 30. And I'm pretty tired still, so I just chill for about like 30 minutes. And then I get into push-ups. I try to do this every day. I try to do 200 push-ups and then some ab workouts. And that's just my morning workout. I try to do that every day. So I did that around 11.30, 12. Then I had lunch. I actually didn't record my lunch, but for lunch I had like a sandwich from this restaurant. I picked it up. It's just chicken and tomato sauce, chicken schnitzel, bread and tomato sauce in a sandwich. And then I add some avocado to that, so it makes it a little more healthy. And then after lunch, I kind of went for a nap because there's not really much to do. And I was extremely tired because sometimes I get I go to sleep really late, but I force myself to wake up at nine every morning just to get that routine going. So I, I usually take a nap in the afternoon because I get really tired. So I take a nap after that until like three o'clock. Then at three o'clock, I try to have another meal. I had a little bit of lasagna and I had a V8 juice with that. So after that, I did some work. I had a couple things to do. I had to do some errands, so I did those until about like seven, then I ate again. I ate one more time, and that time I had, I had some rice, chicken, and broccoli for dinner, and that was pretty good. But then after that, I was supposed to work out with my cousin today, but he was kind of busy, and um, I was kind of texting him the whole day, and around like eight o'clock, I was thinking of going to his house, and then I did up going to his house until like 10 p.m. It was really late when I got to his house. But to be honest, I wasn't really doing much. I was just chilling. After seven, I just ate, I was just chilling, and then I guess at 9 30 10 i went to his house kind of for a last minute workout now i usually don't do these night workouts it was just today because he was really busy today and we usually work out at like two so my ideal plan is to work out in the morning with push-ups do some weight training around midday at round two and then at night hit a, hit a last minute uh night workout and that's what i think is the most effective so i have calisthenics and i have weight training in that so yeah we did some weight training when i got to his house around 10 p.m is when i got there and we did chest and shoulders today, which is one of my favorite days, to be honest. I was trying to record some footage, but my cousin doesn't like me recording, so I just kind of did it at the end when he had to go away. So he had to go inside because he had to do something, and it was around 11 or 11.30, and I continued to work out. And I'm going to play the footage right now, but as you can see, the footage just like cuts off because my SD card actually ran out of storage, which was pretty annoying. So if you want to see the full workout, I made a full workout video of what I did is on my TikTok. TikTok's right here, Josh Tucker Fitness. I also have my arm day and I have a couple other TikToks that you guys should check out. But yeah, so I did my chest and shoulders workout. I got home around like 12 or something, made a little more food. I had more lasagna that I had left over, had some more avocado, and then I also had a protein shake. And that's pretty much all I did today. Today was not really a productive day. I slept a lot. I did not do much that's kind of what life is like in the quarantine i just kind of work out make videos and that's basically it i'm trying to eat more and trying to eat healthier like trying to do a lean bulk right now so honestly that th i think that's the most people can do during this quarantine is just try to eat good because during the year it's very hard to like keep your diet going and keep track of your diet but 
with all this time, I think this is the perfect time to keep your diet going and just be healthy overall. Also, I know that I'm pretty blessed. I do have some weights. My cousin does have dumbbells and barbell. The max weight we can put on the dumbbell is about 50 pounds and the max weight we can put on the barbell is about 160 pounds, I'm guessing, because we don't really know how much the bar weighs. I'm pretty blessed with that, but it's still no excuse for you not to work out because I was working out before I was with my cousin and I was doing a lot of calisthenics. There's a lot of things you could do. You could do push-ups, sit-ups, different variations of push-up. You can do dips. There's a lot of things you could do. You could go do pull-ups. So there's no excuses for that. It's just a little bit easier for me. So yeah, basically a day in the life is like I wake up at nine, I try to work out in the morning, then I have lunch, then I'll have a workout at 2 p.m. Then I'll sleep or just chill until maybe later. And then I'll have a night workout, which my night workout is 200 push-ups and I try to do some abs. The same in the morning. So I'm basically trying to do 400 push-ups a day. I'm trying to increase that. For you at home, I definitely think you should start doing push-ups. Push-ups are definitely the best workout you can do. Like start off with having a goal of like, today, every day I'm gonna do 50 push-ups. Just try to make a goal like that and gradually increase it and like try to, try to challenge yourself. You don't have to do 50 in a row. Like for me, I'm doing 200, I'm doing like 60 in a row, then I'm taking like sets of 20 and I'm just going until 200. It might take 10 minutes, but it doesn't matter. Just keep going until you get to the certain amount that you're looking for. And I do some ab work, which I'll tell you what I do for abs in a different video. Leave a like if you wanna see what I do for my ab workout. It's a really, it's a really hard workout, but I'll tell you what it is if you guys leave a like. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoy a day in the life of a teenage bodybuilder or whatever way you wanna call me. I don't even know what I am, but I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys tomorrow.